44 years as a captain having flown former president Daniel Moi, Mwaikibaki and other foreign presidents. Very responsive, it is fast, uh, it has got good economics. Uh. Today was Colonel Captain James Gitahi's last day flying a commercial flight, 32 years in the Army and 12 at the Bluebird airspace. After 44 years of flying planes in the local and international airspace, it's the final rodeo for one of the Kenya's most experienced pilots. Colonel James Gitahi is captaining his final flight with his family on board. And as the plane touches down on the runway, a water salute is accorded. The ultimate standing ovation marking the end of a long and illustrious career. And then came the parade to signify appreciation for his years of service to the nation and that his work will forever be remembered by those before him and those who come after. He was training my son as a pilot and they picked me out of Wajia and I'm seated at the back of the aircraft and I hear them laughing very loudly at the cockpit and I got worried what is going on. So I walked to the cockpit to find out what is going on and then he tells me, that I'm telling this young man that his, your father trained me and now I'm training you. And your father has been telling me stop smoking. Captain James Gitahi tells us that his journey was filled with highlights that he holds dear. He began his career in the army before branching out into the commercial space. I was both a pilot and as well as an office manager. So I was a commanding officer and at the same time I was flying. So it was quite challenging, but again, the issue was you put your foot, best foot forward and you try to see how you can achieve the best that you can. As a pilot, he got the opportunity to fly presidents here in the country and other heads of state abroad. The first person I started carrying was the President Moy, and I started as a first officer, and I was the first officer to Kanofara. The next person I carried after that was Kibaki, President Kibaki again. Uh, very good muse, laid back, but uh, very amicable. The other president I've carried, I've carried the late Habari Yamana uh, when he came to visit the... Uh, uh, yeah, co- co- remember that, yes. You remember Habari Yamana in Buffalo? Yes. Yes, he had to come to visit Ma- Ma- Mount, Matiba, Mount Kenya. Mount Kenya. Mm. His family says Captain Gitahi has been a role model not only to them but also to the society at large. Thank you very much. And here, where he has served diligently, his services and expertise are something they still wish to hold on to, even just passively. You have retired, but not fully retired because you will still uh, uh, remain in aviation and will gain from all of that vast experience. Roby Omondi, K24.